The thought of what could be happening on the floor above terrifies me. Picture hundreds of angry animals finally escaping, with only one thing capable of giving them peace. And that's to get you and your friends. Their captors. I'm not gonna sugarcoat it. We're in big trouble, partner. We can't stay here long. Unless you want to be swallowed whole with sharp teeth making it easier to digest. Get out of here, partner. in the dark. Let's head to that lot over there. Phew. We should, we should be, be safe, safe for now. miss this place. This is where I took refuge after being dumped down here by your kind. Many cold and lonely nights have been spent here. Ones that I wish to forget. I was found by the Queen at Bittergiggle and a couple of others, and it was foolish enough to let myself believe that things could get better. But here I am, back to square one. Like I told you earlier, need to get the Queen's Scepter as soon as possible. It's the one thing that can allow us to recontain the naughty ones and seal the door behind them. We had it stored in this room away from anyone that could get to it, hoping we would never have to use it again. But here we are. The door opens by activating four switches scattered across the different sectors on this floor. The naughty ones despise the light. You should be safe from them as long as you stay in the lit spaces. The first thing we should do is find a way to safely get to the other sectors. Let's have a look around.
saw you poking through the bushes over there. Did you find something? Hey, partner. You happen to know anything about someone who tricks others and imprisons them? This dame claims someone kidnapped and imprisoned her for some time, but she managed to escape. I didn't get a good look at them. I have a feeling the culprit is incredibly clever and good at what he does, and that he's very handsome. I didn't say that. My gut feeling's never wrong, and something tells me he is very handsome. But you came to the right place, miss. It should be safe here for now. My students are my responsibility. I can't teach them without a full attendance list. The principal would be very mad if I did. We ought to find the culprit. But let's make sure we're alive to do so first. How about you head over to the introduction sector and look for the first switch? I'll have Stinger Flynn transported here. Mrs. Mason, you seem to have been through a lot. And we need everyone to stay focused. I think you should rest for now. Maybe get through this alive.
Are they gone? Don't worry, I... I'm not going to hurt you. I've done enough damage as it is. I know it doesn't make up for what I've done and trying to take you down, but I'm sorry. I truly am. I don't know what came over me. I just couldn't hold myself back. I knew the consequences well, and I still went ahead and said that stupid joke. And now the queen's probably dead because of me. I wouldn't blame you if you don't forgive me, but I will be very thankful if you do. <laughs> Just know that I'll do my best to make up for what I did. You're here for the switch, for the room where the scepter is, right? It's in here, but it's inside of that locker. I can't figure out what to do.
Whatever you plan to do with the lights this dim, do it quickly. The naughty ones know no mercy.
feel much safer with the lights on.
playing outside ends. Don't say a word. Hello? Anybody in there? It's your friend, Ban Ban. I need your help. He's out already? Don't even think about opening this door. video is playing outside ends. Don't say a word. Hello? Anybody in there? It's your friend, Ban Ban. I need your help. He's out already? Don't even think about opening this door. is ending. It's worse than I thought. And it's all because of me. We should go back to wherever you came from. On the way back, I'll think of some jokes that might distract the sheriff from obliterating me on sight.
Guts showing up here, bitter giggle. I should take you out where you stand. Did you really think that I'd allow you in here? And look who it is. My partner in fighting crime turns out to be working with our most wanted criminal behind my back. I had a bad feeling about you the moment I saw you. I wanted to use you as bait for the other criminals. But the queen insisted we give you a chance. Should have gone with my instincts. As usual, I was right. You two should go. Your fate in here won't be much better than your fate out there with the naughty ones. I don't need no partners. I'll find Little Beak, and together, we'll rid the world of monsters like you. No! I'll save you! Let's get out! for now, so there's that. Oh, it's you two. The duel of destruction. Didn't you cause all this to happen? I did. And I plan to make up for it. Everyone that you care to see you redeem yourself is probably already gone. So what's the point? How do you even talk? Jellyfish have no brain. We should go turn on the other switches of the door. Let's head to the potentiality sector next.
Come on, man, we have to get back together. <laughs> Not a chance. Your jokes are trash. You'll have one. You're the joke when you're hopping around like a bunny. We must get back together to prevent.
Look at this place. It seems really familiar, but I'm not sure where I could have ever seen something like this.
trunk. What is that doing in here? Hey, is that guy over there a friend of yours? You can tell him to get down now. 
It's not like we're going to eat his pancreas. So, you are...
but stay together. My head hurts. Did you see where Sir Danadu went after our skirmish? Wait, I know this place. The switch should be on the office above, but getting in there won't be easy. We would have to activate the four locks of the door from down here, but they need fixing first, and they need power. I can fix them if there's power, but I remember the sheriff rigging the power switch so that it would alert the entire facility to our location if activated. It would trigger an alarm, which is sure to attract some unwanted guests. If you could cover me from above while I fix these switches down here, we might just be able to get into that office. I'm ready when you are. Don't panic! That was expected! Keep your eyes on the 12 lights around me. If they turn red, point one of the light poles at them. You can control them.
12 lights around me. If they turn red and point one of the light poles at them, you can control them. If too many turn red without your interference, we're done for! Eyes on the ceiling, too. The light up there needs to be recharged after each use. <laughs> <laughs>